Jeni sana wa Kenya kwa mara nyingine tena mimi ni Brenda Kangai hapa and uh, as you all know that tumekuwa na maandamano on Wednesday, Thursday na Friday leo. Na hiyo maandamano tumekuwa nayo ijakuwa maandamano ya Raila Odinga. Imekuwa maandamano yetu sisi wa Kenya ambao tumefinyiriwa na gharama ya maisha. And what I want to say cause mimi nilena maandamano on Wednesday according to my observation Police officers ndo wamekuwa kimisuse rights za wa Kenya actually violating article 37 of the constitution which allows each and every Kenyan to demonstrate peacefully. Sisi wa Kenya tulitoka very peaceful, tulikuwa na sufuria, tulikuwa na banners, tulikuwa na ile information yenye government inapaswa ijwe tunafinyiliwa. But ile return tunapata tunapata live bullet, not even a rubber bullet, live bullet. So unto you Mr. William Ruto, it is okay you are in power, you, you are misusing the right of Kenyans, but no power is not permanent. There is the day you will get out of that seat and your legacy haita ikumbuka, uta ikumbuka na uzuri yote. Kwa sababu, we cannot allow you as Kenyans to violate the constitution rights zenye zilifaitua 2010, the, the, the constitution rights zenye zilitumia pesa mingi sana before zikuwe pale. For instance, constitution of Kenya at nini 2010, ilitumia pesa mingi sana wa Kenya walienda wakasimama kwa ballot waka vote yes or no wewe mwenyewe ulikuanga against that constitution that's the reason why unafinyilia wa Kenya and you Kenyans because when you go to vote on the ballot you vote according to tribe i think this time round you have learned you have learned that a leader is not from a specific tribe a leader is what he delivers to the people so to you Kenyans nawaambia hivi next time ukisimama kwa ballot yako utwe the decision that will make ita ku cost your decision to make it to make sure either I'm to on a pity life in Missouri, I'm on a pity life in Maya. And another thing, and lastly, Baba Raila Molo Odinga, you have done very, very well. Auja tokea kwa mandamano. So that Kenyans wajue, mandamano aipuwa yako, mandamano ilikuwa ya wa Kenya, ambo na pitia shida. Garami ya maisha lazima ishuke. William Ruto, whether you like it or not, even next week we are going to demonstrate. And not even three days, we will demonstrate the whole week because we are Kenyans. We are facing hardship in our daily lives. So we are telling you this, Mr. William Ruto. It is either upunguze garamia maisha, beyastima ishuke, school fees ishuke, unga ishuke, an affordable life to Kenyans is all what we need. Bullet as it as idea, ato utuwe sisi wote, our voices must be heard. Even if you are going to kill everybody in this country, at the end of the day, our voices must be heard. And another thing, to the people who are arrested, Babu Owino, Gaucho, and the rest, Congratulations, you are the heroes of this country. Now, me arrestiwa juu kitu amkufanya. Especially Babu Owino, ni nini alifanya? Mtu ametoka ziara zake, ametoka matembezi yake, amefika tu yapo tume kwa pingu. What does that tell us? Tumerudi kwa enzi ya moi, yenye kama u support president, wewe ni adui ya serikali. Kama wewe una speak against nini against government kufinyilia wananchi when you are when you are government so we are, what we are telling we william ruto auta turudisha mali tulitoka enzi ya moi tulitoka kitambo na tuwezi rudi babu owino akina gaucho and the rest congratulations you have stood with your country but know that you are arrested illegally na hakuna makosa mlifanya nyinyi wa kenya wametumia nini example yenu kuonyesha kuonyesha kwamba selekari ya william ruto ni serikali katiri, serikali ya umakatiri, serikali ya watu ambao wataki kusikia ukweli. And another thing and the last thing. Utashika aje mtu umtoe Nairobi, umpeleke wanguru. Umpeleke uruke tu counties. Unena kumfanya nini huko? Mtu akishikwa na paswa pelekwa to the nearest police station. Na the following day apelekwe kotini. Aswa mwe mashitaka yake. Sisi kama wakenye tujue nini ya mefanya. Amwezi kwa mnashika watu for apparently no reason. Nashiko watu mnaweka pingu. Nashiko watu mnaweka pingu. Sa babu wino ni nini alifanya? Mimi nauliza. Ama ni yeti babu wino na wengine wenye walishikuwa kona deni ya gachieta. Tumchangie. You know we can put a pay bill number and kama wakona deni ya gachieta tuamlipa. So what I'm telling you, style up, govern the people, acheni bullshit, acheni kutumia wa Kenya vibaya. We elected you. And the same same way, yenye mulia kwa wenye watu walisema kumera kumera wakiweka ndani. It is the same same way. 2027 watu wanaenda kuwatoa. Don't think that you have been intimidated as William Ruto. Enough is enough. Demonstration next week kama kawaida. Tutatoka tena na tena. Tuona kama utashoot kila mtu inch.